Hello everybody, uh, this is my most recent build. Um, this is Omen, um, a very, very Sith Saber. Um, this is not for the light side or the Jedi at all. Uh, it's powder coated in wrinkled black, got this knurled grip section back here, um, and it's very reminiscent of a, an evil Sith Saber with the pseudo uh, kind of Darth Vader emitter on it. Um, go ahead and boot it up. It is running a Petit Crouton 2.0. Um, I'm running two br very, very blindingly bright, and you'll see in a second, red LEDs and one white LED for flash on clash. It is a tri Cree, uh, one white, two red, three LEDs, tri Cree. And they're Cree LEDs. Um, this one is built for heavy dueling. Um, this is definitely. Um, a durable lightsaber. Um, on the very back, you are on the front, you have your main activation red illuminated switch, ring switch, and then on the back, it's a flush mount tactile uh, switch for your auxiliary. Uh, blade retention, thumb screw. I'm really liking thumb screws as opposed to. Um, the ones with the Allen keys. Um, this also does have the recharge and the rice port in the rear um, of the saber. So uh, using the real-time internal configuration editor, uh, you can actually change the uh, the sensitivity of the saber, um, the brightness of the saber, um, you know, definitely do all those tweaks uh, just by plugging it into your computer um, and using the Rice software. Uh, so it's pretty cool. Uh, let me go ahead and turn it on for you. It is a blindingly bright red. Um, these reds are super bright. It's a very loud saber. Uh, it does have a flash on clash feature. It's got a very, uh, very Sith sound font on it currently. Um, I think it's Revenge. Uh, might not be, uh, not too sure. Um, and one of my favorite things uh, about the Petit Crouton 2.0, um, in the event that you, uh, let's say, are cosplaying or trooping or something of that nature, um, there's a nice little feature on the Petit Crouton 2.0. Um, if you hold down the auxiliary button while pressing the power button, the saber will come on and you'll get light but no sound. Um, it's great. It does conserve a little bit of battery life and uh, you don't have those constant swings and clashes and a very loud hum for a, a long time. Especially when you're just trying to take pictures or something along those lines. Uh, as soon as you turn the saber off, the sound will go back on as you turn it off. And it'll be ready to turn on as soon as you turn it on again. So, this is Omen. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and that's it.